It's a wrap up of Avalon 2023. This has been the biggest and best Avalon uh, that I've ever been to. Here's a wrap up of all of those people that we've spoken to within space, defence, drones and computing. Enjoy. My first Avalon and it's the first time we brought a UK delegation out. So again, really exciting. Um, and again, 30 companies with uh, a lot of different expertise as well. We've got everything from sort of uh, optical communications to satellite building. Um, and then everything in between. Well, I certainly hadn't appreciated the scale of this, so to be part of it is, is, uh, is fantastic for us. Excellent, you know, it's, it's very no crowded. Uh, a lot of, you know, companies. Uh, we are really surprised and really encouraged, uh, and certainly we will come back uh, next year. It's my first Avalon. Great to be here, it's amazing so far. Oh, wonderful, a wonderful experience. Noisy, but wonderful experience. And of course, extremely excited to be meeting all of our partners here. Uh, fantastic, just the opportunity to meet and catch up uh, with people from all around Australia, all around the world, uh, including US, UK, Germany, um, it's been fantastic, so great coverage. Oh, it's been great, it's been really, um, real diverse and I'm really enjoying seeing that there's a lot more small companies, um, more than you know, all the big ones you expect to see, but it's really nice to see the small and also the international. International partnerships has been great. Avalon, Avalon has been fantastic. Again, I have met with, I, I've just been busy meeting with so many people here. A lot of times you'll come to a conference and you'll just sit and watch panels or, you know, you, uh, you, you, you end up occupied at a booth somewhere. But this has really been about networking. And that's, that's what's been great about Avalon. It's been, I've, I've networked with as many people from the space ecosystem here as possible. I think this is one of the bigger space showings that they've had at Avalon um, in, in its history. So, you know, that's been fantastic for us. It's very important to know what is out there, what is in the market, what are our capabilities, what are others' capabilities. So definitely I'm looking at collaborations, um, partnerships, and uh, uh, understanding of uh, what are the needs and uh, where we are going and what is happening. This is not my first Avalon, but it's my first Avalon with space being a new command. Um, and it's just really exciting. It's really good. We've just had the first three industry days and it's been great meeting with a bunch of new players in the space industry, startups to some of our long-term primes working together in this, this space space. Avalon's been a fantastic show. Amazing exposure for us um, as a growing company um, under the ACT banner. It's really allowed us to connect in a way that you know wouldn't, is, is ex exponentially larger than just us standing on our own and it's fantastic to see so many camera companies in the same place. Well Avalon Show is just amazing. It's, it's a lot of different variety of things happening uh, in, within the aviation sector, especially after the COVID time. Um, I think it's, it's, it's just phenomenal. It's, it's just really, really good to be here. It is our first Avalon, so it's very different to let's say Indopac or Land Forces and it's a different kind of clientele of the different needs. This is our first Avalon Air Show exhibiting uh, on behalf of Swoop Aero. We're really excited to have the team here not only to display our impact that we have as a company but our growth, our technology and also the value we're adding to the Victorian economy uh, with our advanced manufacturing setup in the Fisherman's Bend precinct. This is our first exhibition at Avalon. We're very excited to be here. We've attended Land Forces in Indo-Pacific before, but this is the first time, not only we're attending at, at Avalon, but the first time we've brought Blue Room out into the public. Uh, we've been before as an exhibitor. Uh, I think today we're just uh, doing a bit of networking and looking around, uh, but Quickstep is flying the flag, having one of our airframes on their stand. So, as we let the jets go past, so what we're starting to do now, we're told we're integrating these systems into their uh, search and rescue and their, and their medical evacuation areas. Um, which tolls one of the biggest uh, search and rescue and, and medical deliveries in Australia.